Hi everyone, I'm George, Student Learning Officer at Bristol FSU. I'm here with Ros today to talk about um, community building in halls. Hello, I'm Ros Elliott, Head of Student Residential Life. I look after the three residential life villages and also uh, the accommodation office. So student experience from right when people arrive right through to their experience in the first year is really important to us. We'd like to know how the um, Res Life are going to support JCLs this year and what actions have, have been taken. Yeah, so as a new service, um, we had a lot of lessons to learn and it was great to have valuable feedback from the JCRs about where perhaps we can support them better. So I think a key point was training. So when they arrive, fully equipping them for the role and letting them know what they need to know. Um, part of that is having key contacts within the residential life team. So on the ground, senior residents, um, RLAs within the office, for some of the administrative functions, and then heads and depths for any sort of uh, management or financial support. Having uh, simplified paperwork as well, um, so still managing risk of events but being able to log things online where possible. So how are communities being built up in halls and what activities and events are being put on place? So it's really important when students first arrive in Bristol that they have an excellent welcome um, so they feel part of their residence and the wider community. So with the support of outgoing JCRs it's really important that we put on events that students um, want to, to engage with and want to attend. Um, so there's lots of range of, of whole things within the residence and out in the local area that they can get involved in. I think the residential life team also looks at, at seasonal activities, so links up with other campaigns the student union or the university are doing, um, supporting people through difficult times of uh, exam stress and that kind of thing with a focus on well-being. But of course it's really important for JCRs to, to, to have, be the voice of students within a residence to say what they want and to be able for us to support them um, in that to put on whatever the activities are. Examples of things we've done are, are uh, craft activities, um, visits out to the local community, um, bringing speakers into halls, film nights, quizzes, anything to bring people together to make sure that they are getting to know um, and have a sense of belonging within their residence. Great. So why is it important to have a community feel in halls? Of course if you're coming to Bristol as a new city, a new place to be, it's really important that people feel a sense of belonging, that they're not isolated, everybody feels alone when they first arrive, but creating lots of different opportunities for people to come together, discover new things or get stuck into things they've already enjoyed doing before they've got here, it's really important for us to, to make sure we have all those opportunities um, you know, at people's fingertips. Yeah. So is there anything else you'd like to say? Um, yeah, so it's really important for us to hear from students about what's important to them and what's going to help them um, get the best out of their university mm -hmm. life, especially from, from living in, in halls. Um, so I would urge students to get involved with their JCR, use the resources that the SU provide. The SU uh, have lots of forums for, for the students to be able to raise their concerns, um, but to have that partnership and for us to be able to, to facilitate what they, they want and need to be able to, to flourish is really important. Brilliant. So thanks very much for coming today and talking to me. Thank you. Thank you.